so I gotta do some about the map. Is this like a whoa? There is a dialogue tree. The map sensitivity is like super low for vertical. That really messes me up. Hey guys, how you doing? <sighs> well, that wasn't the right way to do things. Loading, loading, loading. Okay, I just gotta use I just got up in this dude's face and got EXP for telling him he's a bitch. And shut the fuck up. I love this game. It's like Mass Effect except better in every way whatsoever. No aliens though. Needs some aliens, maybe. Not really, but you know. At least maybe it'll inspire the next Mass Effect game. To no, wait. Too late, it's already like halfway done. Yeah. You can't pick up everything though, it makes me sad. I wish it was like uh, Half Life where you could pick up like cigarettes and throw them at people. really good. Assertive and aggressive. That's good. I always play as the nice guy in these games, so give it a different shot. I figure I'll go nice guy first and dick second, but even as a nice guy, you want to look like a good Oh, yeah, definitely. We need to repair that artery. Yeah, at first, you don't see half the stuff because you're not really like augmented, but then you get augmented and it's like, hello, bud. It was Too. Also, Ghost in the Shell. That too, Ghost in the Shell. Yeah, he's not good to be like this. It's an interesting title sequence, so I can see why so many, you know, types of media have used it. Because it's a way to sh kind of show a little bit to the process, as well as, you know, give uh, some low action time for the credits. You know, the big credits. Also, if you have sight for you can get yeah, probably. I love you. Haven't you lost enough people today? I'm sorry.
god, he's giving me lethal or non-lethal. I'm doing non-lethal because that's not casual mode. Oh. Uh, that also I'm means a... you're a nice guy, though. Well, I guess uh, you can just kill people with the lethal melee attacks, though, if you want. Yeah. I guess it was more like... I didn't think of it that I thought of it was like... The non-lethal takedowns in Deus Ex were, like, really hard to do. Uh... The non-lethal taser is honestly a good weapon, though. It's got a short range, but it's an insta, you know, takedown. And you can Let's see. Anywhere. Yeah, there's two yeah, weapons yeah. I can pick here. The distance weapon, which is a trank rifle, and the stun gun, short range. I'll take the stun gun. Good choice. I have this feeling that if I take the trank rifle, they're going to be all, like, wandering around until they fall out, you know, and just I fall asleep. I think it drops the pretty much as Either way, it just makes the game harder. I'm trying to play on anti-casual difficulty to see how hard this game gets. For fun, attack the police. It gets real hard. Do what? Attack the cops. Oh, ho, ho. There's gonna be a lot of cops here. You can make them your enemy, but... Uh, unless you do something like, um... I think if you get the turret, you can probably kill them all. Adam! Carry the turret around. David. People did that in the league. You in the building? Just enter the lobby. Sorry to pull you out of sick leave so soon, but uh, we've got a situation. A break-in at a Milwaukee Junction factory. Meet me at the helipad. Let me talk. I have to see Pritchard first. Something's wrong with my retinal enhancement. Frank's on the second floor in the tech lab. Make it quick. Oh man, it's like I'm in crisis. My God, better. Mr. Jensen, I, I didn't think you'd. Oh boy, the familiar, you know, one through zero thing is back. I love that. Did you need directions or something? It hasn't been that long, Cindy. I may not look the same, but my memory's pretty intact. Oh, I, I didn't mean... I mean, of course, your memory's fine, sir. It's just that well, things have been switched around a lot ever since the... Well, since the... Ever since the first attack? Yes, sir. The lab floors were pretty much demolished. We're rebuilding them, but most of our researchers are working off-site now. Everyone else has been shuffled around, so if you need help finding someone... You said everyone's been moved around? Almost everyone. Who are you looking for? Oh, it's got that square inventory. You know, I just hit no, whatever sir. button to you use it. still have that great view School. of the lobby. Little cubes. Mr. Pritchard wanted it, but Mrs. Margulis put a stop to that. Up two floors and make a right. My office is That's a what I'm here for. Vision, Anything else, sir? No reason. Yeah. Where's the tech lab? It's not really a lab, sir. It's more of an office with a lot of computer equipment shoved in it. Mr. Pritchard complains about it all the time. Uh, go up the stairs behind me and take a right. You'll find it near the end of the hall. I don't suppose we moved the helipad, did we? I, I don't see how we could have moved it. <laughs> Oh, you're teasing me. <laughs> Very funny, Mr. Jensen. Go up the stairs to the second floor, then around the cafeteria to the exit. I think I saw Farida heading there earlier. You said everyone's been moved around? Almost. Thanks. That's what I'm here for. I'll find me. If you... Did you... I'll find my... Imp Yes? Attention, Ellen Marcy. Sounds like extremists. Mr. Jensen, Ellen you're Marcy, looking well. Did you come in to find out about Jensen? the break-in? I'm sure Athena God, and Mr. Seraph know what's Didn't going on. Didn't expect to see you back so soon. Mr. Seraph might be headed to the plant, but Athena should be up in his offices. I trust her before trusting the news. Mr. Seraph might be headed to the plant, Second but Athena should months. be up in his offices. Only this time I trust at the her before plant. trusting the news. It can't just be a coincidence. almost fully recovered. His body accepted augmentations with remarkable ease, but that doesn't mean his mind did. Jensen, uh, didn't hear you coming. You should probably be heading for the helipad, don't you think? I'll get there. But I thought I'd better clear up a few things first about my current mental state. Heard that, did you? Look, I'm sorry. It's just that 
Well, what I'm happened to you was horrible. Most people. people don't recover this fast. And you think sitting at home and obsessing over it is the better way to go? Of course not. It's just... Things have been pretty rough around here, Jensen. The last thing any of us needs is more funerals. Agreed. Oh, and by the way, that Mexican town massacre was a complete bohica. But I wasn't fired because of it. I quit. There's a difference? Yeah. A little thing called integrity. You might want to look it up someday. Ah. Uh, uh, well, um, welcome back, Mr. Jensen. The new look suits you. Good luck tonight. You had your say, and I learned my lesson. Don't do drugs, kids, unless you're augmented, then take a whole bunch of painkillers. You're all presumed. Jensen, good to have you back, man. I can't tell you how relieved we were to hear you were going to make it. What do you, not everyone... If you throw around junk long enough, mm -hmm. it's fragile, it'll break. That's pretty problem. sweet. The sacrifices our scientists made for this company. For the world, even. Yeah, it's the reminding part that bothers me. I've been in therapy for months trying to forget that night. Seeing the... I'm sorry. I can't imagine how difficult it's been for you. You probably just want to forget, huh? Yeah, it's the reminding part that bothers me. I've been in therapy for months trying to forget that night. Seeing the bodies coming out all... So they give me two routes. I'm like in this very happy. Look suits you. Guess you'll be hanging around the tech boys a little more now, huh? By the way, they moved the tech lab to the second floor. Mr. Pritchard was pissed. Said something about climbing stairs. Fucking prima donna. By the way, they moved the tech lab... Hey, boss. Good to have you back. Um, I don't want to rush you, but any idea when you might be hiring more staff? We've been putting in a lot of hours since, well, you know, we lost some good guys. Anyway. Dr. Sandusky, please report to testing lab 1C. Dr. Sandusky, to testing lab 1C. Man, I didn't believe it when they said you were coming back, boss. Not the way you were busted up. I'm sorry about Dr. Reed and the others. I know you and her had history. Sorry, I shouldn't have brought it up. Hey, Adam. I can't tell you how glad I am you're back. Pritchard's been trying to order everyone around since you've been gone. Dick, I'm glad I don't have to work that close with him. Pritchard's been trying to order everyone around since you've been gone. Factory workers have been taken hostage to the contracts we've lost because of the last attack and the Washington hearings being postponed. Jensen? Jeez, wasn't expecting you back for weeks yet. If ever. All the sorry, can't talk right now. Too much work these days. All the contracts we lost because of the last attack and the Washington hearings being postponed. Now this. Damn fanatics. Do you think the news is right? That a pro-human group is behind this, Mr. Cannon? Don't oh man, I drew a box and pull these guys' heads and he fucking so shoot me. Isn't bad enough. We got to defend <laughs> ourselves against a bunch of self-righteous lunatics being so understaffed. You're not complaining now, are you, Dobell? No, Mr. Cannon. Sorry. Sorry, Mr. Jensen, but things are really unsettled right now. Mr. Pritchard in the tech lab can probably tell you more. Good to have you back, though. You're looking great. Jensen? What are you doing here? I wouldn't have put two credits down on you ever walking again, let alone coming back to work. 